Okay, got in Los Angeles at the LAX, about to pick up the rental car uh, and meet uh, Nader, um, AKA Freak Eating um, on YouTube. So uh, you will see us do a pho challenge. I think it's called Pho Ha Number Seven. I think that's the name of the place. So, but it's a big bowl of pho. I think you get two hours to do it. It's supposed to be a big bowl of uh, broth, um, two pounds of noodles and two pounds of meat. I am hungry. That um, that pho challenge we did last night uh, actually tasted pretty good. I um, had a good time with Natter. Um, had Edward, a um, uh, member of the disposal team, show up. So he uh, he bought a T-shirt as well. So I really appreciated that and um, enjoyed herself last night. Uh, to, that's what she said. Um, today, woke up in Planet Fitness uh, parking lot. Um, because I was going to take a shower and we'll hit the treadmill and then take a shower. Um, today is the hot dog contest. It's a 15 minute contest at the hive. Um, it is Wildemore, California and, uh, 15 minutes is going to suck. That's what she said. <laughs> but, uh, it's a thousand dollars and, um, uh, I don't want to pass that up. After plane tickets, tax, uh, paying taxes on the money if I win, and the rental car, it's only like $300 uh, after all the expenses. So it's not much money. Um, so that's why I do the videos as well. The vlogs aren't getting many views right now. Um, but this is the way of my life that I'm going to go. Um, I, I can't do the eating forever. Um, I'm not going to wait till I get a heart attack. I'm like, oh, got a heart attack. I guess I'll quit now. Uh, so I want to do like a food truck as well, uh, in the future. I know I talked about it before, but I really do want to do a food truck. Uh, actually I, I want to do a food truck with my girlfriend. Um, I know I beat around the bush last time about, uh, I don't know what else I want to do. Well, that's exactly what I want to do. Um, if that's something that she wants to do, I want to show people exactly how I got the food truck, exactly how I got the licensing, exactly everything. So if you guys want to do a food truck, uh, or open up a business, you can go to the beginning of that vlog of the, the food, uh, truck vlog and start from scratch. Like, Hey, how do you do this? How do you get the, the, the health license? How do you do this? I want to do that for guys that and gals that want to uh, get into the business um, and just think that it's going to be too difficult to do. Uh, anything in life that you do that, that that you have your heart set on is worth the work, okay? Um, sometimes it pays off, sometimes it don't, but you never know unless you go. That's all I say. Um, I just put my foot out there and sometimes it gets stepped on, a lot of times it don't, but you don't never know unless you do it. Um, like I said before on what I definitely want to do, I definitely just want her to do what she wants to do on cooking. You know, she says she can cook pretty good. So I got faith in her. Okay. I trust her. So she just wants to do soul food. Um, I was thinking about trying to mix up St. Louis and the Memphis food, but I'm going to put that on her. I'm like, if she wants to do soul food, do what you want to do. All I want to do basically is sell my pickles. So I'll have those, uh, my banana breads, gooey butter uh, cakes, and pumpkin breads. Uh, 
I still want to do that. So other than that, um, heck, I'll be there just to support what she's doing and help her cook. If she she likes me to be a sous chef, I'll be a sous chef. I'm not I'm not that uh, belittle to do that. You know, as long as I'm with her, that's all that matters, you know. Um, I don't care what in life that happens. I want to vlog um, with her and do other stuff and food reviews. And we was talking to, uh, when I was in the airport and she was saying something about, have you been such and such place? I said, babe, I have not been 99% of these restaurants because I am so cheap. People think that, you know, I eat all these other places. I eat the places that you see because they have food challenge. But like Chick-fil-A, never been to a Chick-fil-A. Well, I've been inside because she actually went and I actually dropped my daughter off at one a while, a few years ago. Uh, but I've never ate at a Chick-fil-A. Um, never ate at an In-N-Out burger place. I've never eaten at a water burger place. Um, a wing stop. So I don't go to places because I just don't want to spend my money. Uh, basically, McDonald's is usually where I go to edit videos, and that's pretty much I eat some of that. Uh, that's what she said. So a lot in the future would be vlogs. Um, I'm going to try to get extra stuff for vlogs other than just eating, but I do both food reviews. Um, I'm going to do my bad acting, so you're welcome in advance. I'm going to get into Planet Fitness, and I'm going to um, get this treadmill action, work up some um, appetite for these hot dogs later, and hit the shower. That's what I do. I, I'm going to do that for the people on the plane, because I'm going to tell you on the plane, every time on the plane, there are some funky people out there. What is wrong with you? Some people smell like burnt garlic. Um, I remember taking that picture and sending it to my girlfriend and me putting tissue on my nose. I had tissue on my nose on that flight. It was so nasty. The guy beside me, man, he got drunk on burnt garlic and something else. Ooh, almost made me throw up. And then people, the underarms. Where's some deodorant, people? What is wrong with you people? Where's some deodorant? Like they forgot, like, it's, it's it's a big tin can. We're in a tin can. It's like tuna and burnt Fritos. I'm in front of the hive. Uh, we're going to have a hot dog contest today. This is in Wildemore, California. And I tell people, when I, every time I say Wildemore, I think of Harry Potter for some reason. Because somebody, Baltimore, or not Baltimore, it's a, uh, you know what I'm talking about. If you watch Harry Potter, I don't watch it much, but I know there's a name in there like Wildemore. Okay, it sounds like it. In comments, you let me know because I know you're going to do it anyway. Uh, but this is a 15-minute contest at the hive. Um, <clears throat> Today is a special day for them. Today is a not so special day for me. Uh, these people opened up the day my buddy died on August the 17th of 2018. Today is August the 17th, 2019. So my buddy um, had died one year ago today. Uh, so uh, bittersweet day today um, at this event. So uh, 15 minutes of hot dogs. Um, 10 minutes of hot dogs really uh, suck. So 15 minutes is really going to suck. So I'm probably going to be um, zoning out a lot and probably zoning out uh, about my best friend, okay? Uh, the name of Andre Sawyer. Uh, when I get home, I'll be going to his, uh, his grave and talking to him for a while. Uh, hopefully let him know that I won today. So we'll see. And there'll be nine other contestants, so there's ten of them here. And uh, this is just about an hour, maybe two hours, two hours uh, south or east, actually, of Los Angeles. Um, if you didn't check the, the videos out, um, I, I've I posted, uh, I might have posted uh, last week or a couple of days ago. Um, I didn't edit any of the videos yet. I'm still on the road. But <clears throat> using my videos, excuse me, using my videos about a month and a half out. 
But this one's going to be, um, I did the, the Fa Ha number seven. I guess there's seven of them or more. I, I forgot to ask them why they called them Fo Ha seven. But by the time I do the video, I'm going to ask Nader that was with me. Um, he has about 115,000 subscribers. Um, so uh, check his channel out. I'll put it in the descriptions as well. Uh, we had a really good time. Uh, two big bowls of pho, two pounds of noodles, two pounds of uh, meat, and then a lot of broth. So check that out. Check my vlog out. The vlogs that I'm making of these videos uh, are going to be in descriptions as well. If I missed it, just vlog the California trip, the hive trip, something like that. So if you follow me, uh, you'll, 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 you'll hear about it on the lives, okay? So I appreciate it very much for you guys following me. Uh, you guys rock. I mean, you guys make me the person I am today. Not all of it, I'm not going to lie to you. But uh, you do help me out on uh, YouTube by watching the videos and watching the advertisements. And I always say, hey, please, please watch the, advertise, uh, the advertisements because it helps me out. and It keeps me doing what I'm doing. This is my job, and that's who pays me. So um, if you don't want to watch a 10, 15-minute ad, because I wouldn't, I would watch the video and then rewind it. Please be kind, rewind. But uh, you might be, you, you might, you guys not not the old enough to even know what that means on the VC, the VCR tapes. But uh, please just uh, click it to the beginning and set the phone down after you watch it, and then let the videos, the advertisements play to help me out. So uh, we're gonna get in here and uh, get this uh, contest started. Hey, uh, they switched the contest to uh, 10 minutes instead of 15 minutes. So I really did appreciate that. Uh, we had a really good time. Uh, if you're listening to the vlog right now, uh, go back and watch the video. If you're watching the video right now, uh, watch the vlog. So uh, I really appreciate it, guys. Um, I say that a lot because I really do. I'm not just saying it. Um, you are a big part of my life. Uh, half, at least half of YouTube is my financial, uh, me paying my bills and everything. So. Uh, that's why I try to comment on everybody's comment. I, I just try to get back to you guys, go live, and, and, and interact with you guys because I do care. So uh, thank you very much, and talk to you later. Almost forgot. So, some people always want to see the cash. Like they don't, they don't believe me or something. But usually, if I if there's a thousand dollar contest and I won, if I didn't get paid, you would definitely hear about it. But as I said, YouTube. Uh, you guys are half of my financial uh, bill payings that you guys helped me out on. Uh, this is the other half. There you go. That's real dollars, hopefully. We'll know when I try to cash them. But they had they have really great uh, staff here. The owner, we talked for a while afterwards. Uh, the radio station was here. Uh, really had a good time. So next year, if you're around the Wildemore, California area, uh, call them around the first of august to see if they're going to have the contest and maybe i might be back and you'll see me here so till then guys toodles okay i am at old hawaiian barbecue i'm about to do that that uh challenge they have uh, check out the challenge in about a month and a half or so from seeing this vlog and uh, You will see if I won or not, okay? Okay, just in my car. I've been here about two hours um, Just relaxing in the car until I dropped the rental car off about About that way about a half a mile, so I'm gonna drop it off here. I'm had a good time in California, even though I didn't do anything extra, except uh, Bubba came to see me um, at the uh, how what do you say it? Ola Hawaiian Barbecue. Uh, he came to see me up there. So uh, a subscriber, a member to the disposal team. So I appreciated him for coming up, um, um, even though he had called and. Um, the place said that there was open until nine. So when I called earlier, well, they put a note in the door say they close at seven. I didn't know that I was going to sleep till seven and then go do the challenge. But luckily I was reading my comments and, and, and um, trying to comment back on the comments. And he had said, I just try to call the place closes at seven. So I'm glad um, I got to do it earlier. But by the time he got up there, I was already done eating. 
but we got to talk for about another hour after that. I sat there and downloaded my stuff from my phone and bring GoPro to my SD card. So we got to chat for a while. So um, I really appreciate him coming up there. And if you look in descriptions, you'll see some of his information. Um, he, uh, he does shirts. So if you want to uh, give him a ring, if you're around the California area or if he uh, uh, delivers um, online, I think he has online as well. So I'll give you his information in the descriptions um, and you can get a hold of him. So just drop this car off and head to the airport. Hey guys, I have t-shirts in all the way from small to 5X with have a great day unless you made other plans on the back. They are very, very soft, high quality. I pay extra for that so you guys uh, can get a quality shirt. Pre-washed material before I put the logo on it so it won't shrink on you. Uh, shipping and handling is in the descriptions. Look in that of the videos and see how to send the payment in. If you haven't already, please go to Facebook under the Garbage Disposal and hit follow so you get more information of where I'm at. Subscribe to my page, hit the notification bell to get notified of upcoming events, and live streams, and videos. Uh, please hit the like button for me, and uh, if you could, please share with your family, friends, and even your boss. Have a great day, unless you made other plans. <laughs>